I'd say the drought itself was comparable, maybe even worse. But, you know, our agronomic uh, practices are so much different, so much irrigation, you wouldn't have known it hardly. But we actually, in the 30s, they claimed we had usually a kind of, kind of an average, we'd get 12 or 13 inches of rain a year. Last year, at 19, or 2012, I think Grand Island only had nine something inches of rain up until after the corn was harvested. Then we got a little in the snowfall. I think they ended up with 11 inches, but that was lower than any r recorded time as far as rainfall is concerned. So as far as the actual drought, it was just as bad, if not worse. But it was sure different. Nearly all the corn is irrigated. Uh, the, the things that really suffered, I believe, are the pastures, the dryland pastures. And uh, even this spring, you can see where a lot of the grass has died. And uh, it's going to take a little while, I think, for those pastures to get grass growing in some of those drought areas. But the pastures, I think that I think the pastures suffered more than anything else. Of course, if you had dry land corn or something, usually that was a zero or two. But and the rains were somewhat spotted. Even in some of the areas, they didn't get very much rain, but they would still get fifty or sixty bushel. That wouldn't have happened back in the thirties at all. It it just took a little rain to help a lot. A lot of the corn didn't get that little rain, didn't get any, so there was zero.